guys and welcome to this interview get ready with me and productive day. There's going to be a lot of activities in this little vlog and I'm just going to start off with getting ready for a web interview I had for a job. So I have some exciting news. I actually graduated from my master's program in health science. So I am going to be starting a career as a health professional and I'm super excited. This is me just getting ready for an interview that I will be doing on Line. I'm wearing my business casual attire, of course, with this collared light pink shirt, as well as some white striped pants and a belt. Of course, on the web interview, you will only see from the waist up. First, I'm just going to be combing through my hair and using some of this Not Your Mother's Refreshing Clean Freak Dry Shampoo in the citrus scent. I'm just incorporating that into my scalp just to freshen up my hair. I'm going to put my hair up as I do my makeup, starting off with the Master Prime Green Shade Primer, as well as the Neutrogena Skin Clearing Makeup Concealer on some blemishes. I'm then going to be following that up with the Neutrogena Skin Clearing Foundation, and then just blending that in with a beauty blender. My goal with this makeup was to look very bright, put together, and clear, but not be overdoing it. I just wanted my skin to look healthy, and I wanted to have a positive brightness to my skin. I'm going to be setting in the foundation and concealer with the Neutrogena Skin Clearing Mineral Powder, and then I'm also going to be applying a pop of this rose shade of the Physician's Formula Blush. I'm just going to be combing through my eyebrow with this e.l.f. eyebrow pencil spoolie brush and that is going to complete the makeup look. I wanted to apply some of this Coach New York perfume that I got as a graduation gift. I normally don't wear perfume but this scent is just so nice. It's a very clean feminine scent and then I'm also going to be packing with me this Kate Spade striped clipboard and notepad, as well as a matching tumbler with a straw. These are graduation gifts that I got and I really cherish them. I'm just going to be using the notebook to write down some notes on the company I was interviewing for and just to write down any notes that I find useful during the interview. I'm actually going to be taking my interview outside at the library here. It was just the perfect setup. It was very bright, sunny, and I felt like the interview went well. So I just got back from my interview at the library. I pretty much studied the whole morning and just prepared for the interview. I practiced some interview questions and then just made sure I well researched the company that I was interviewing for. I think it went pretty well. I was a little bit nervous, but that's to be expected. And I just did my best. I showed my best, friendliest personality and I just answered the questions honestly. So we will see what happens after this interview. Hopefully I get the job. I'm really interested in this position. So now I am just back home. I'm going to change out of my professional business clothes and get into something more comfy. I'm going to have a healthy meal and then I'm just going to get right into studying for the rest of the day. I say that I will be studying because I have a huge boards exam that I have to take in a couple of weeks. I'm just using this fragrance-free makeup remover wipe by the CVS brand. This is just comparable to the Neutrogena makeup wipes and it just works by removing my makeup before I get into the shower. Next, I'm just going to take a nice relaxing shower, including shampooing my hair. This just gives me a fresh start, a boost of energy, and is just a nice clean reset to start the afternoon. For my skincare, I'm going to be applying this Hyaluronic Acid Serum. I just make this at home with some vegetable glycerin, Hyaluronic Acid Powder, and a little bit of distilled water. This is going to cause all of the moisture to draw into my skin and just fully hydrate it after the shower. I'm also going to be applying some of this Vitamin C Serum afterwards, as well as a Crystal Deodorant and some Hero Rescue Balm on a blemish. 
I'm going to have a nice healthy meal of some salmon, couscous, eggplant, and avocado. And then I'm pretty much going to be studying the whole rest of the day. I had a snack of apples and peanut butter later on, but I like to study just by taking notes. I find that this just makes the information stick so much better and it holds my attention span longer. I have a whole study plan organized for my board's certification exam where I'm going through each of the topics that will be on the exam and just making sure I am well informed on all of the diseases, treatments, pharmacology, anatomy, physiology, and everything there is to know. Once I have studied for a few hours, I wanted to go to the gym. I like to go to the gym late at night because there is less people here. On um, this evening, I did an arm workout. So as you can see, I'm just doing some bicep curls and then I'm going to do this tricep press here. My goal is to build strength and just maintain my cardiovascular health. I'm also going to be using the hydro massage bed at the gym here. This just helps relax my back and neck muscles and I really enjoy this part of the gym. Once I get back home, I'm going to be focusing on cleaning and organizing my kitchen. I just changed into some comfortable pajamas and I'm going to just start off by unloading the dishwasher. Later on, I'm going to be scrubbing and wiping the counters as well as cleaning the sink. I'm just going to leave everything nice and neat and organized to start the next productive day. So I hope you guys enjoy this relaxing kitchen clean with me. is going to be pretty much it for this productive interview day. I wanted to give you guys the news that I actually did get the job. So I will be starting work in October, hopefully, but I'm just going to be studying for my boards until then and just trying to make more videos for you guys. I'm really excited for this next season of fall and I'm going to try to get some videos up that I filmed over the summer as well. I hope everyone is doing well. Thank you so much for watching. On my channel, I have more productive vlogs, cleaning motivation, healthy habits, recipes, meal prepping, and beauty related videos on my channel. So, so if you guys are interested in that, I would highly recommend checking my channel out and subscribing. Thank you.